check out today. Hello. We got a leaner. How much is this weight, bro? 49,163. So we'll call it 50. Just, yeah, just, just uh, the box. Yeah, and these little half sets are what, like 8,000 pounds that it's on? Uh, yeah, pretty much. I would stand clear of there just in case, bro. If anything goes over, you don't want to be on that yeah, side. Yeah. Well, now I got to find out if it's shifted. 6,500. Oh, these straps held up incredibly well. So what do you want us to... It didn't shift, did it? That's not a good trailer. This is too high, bro. This has to be on a low bed. Your center of gravity is all jacked up. That's why. Look how high you are. You know what? We, we've been telling them that we have to do the low boys. And what? Your management doesn't listen? Well, this is going to cost them now. Um... Do they have another low bed we can transport it on? Yeah. Okay. I can get is somebody, it in route? I can get somebody right now with a trailer. All right, that's gonna be our bet because this is suicide, bro. If you, if all I can do, well, what can I do? Your load isn't shifted. It's it's gonna stay like this. this hey. is, I was gonna say the only other option is is pick up the rear and swing it so it's more level. But you're going down this turn, you're gonna flip. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. So what I'm gonna do is we're gonna pick it up on each end, scare the whole thing in the air, you drive out from underneath, your other guy will be up here and you'll back up underneath and we'll put it on like a low bed. Let's get the other guy there. Let's take a walk around. Should be easy for Hulk and Big Flipper. The only thing is, uh, this is a highly congested area. This is the 47 freeway, the seaside freeway to the 110. So all these trucks are coming out from the port. Look at the landing gear right here. There's some miracle ratchet straps, man. You probably use this over chain to protect the load, even though it's got a cover. But uh, it held up well. The load isn't shifted. It's these trailers. I, I'm sure if you're familiar with my channel, you see my other videos. We get them all the time, where people transport stuff like this, and look where it's sitting at relative to me. This is like shoulder length. And when your center of gravity is that high, you throw in some sharp turns like this and it's a recipe for disaster. Not good at all. Now my only thing is, is where to park the trucks. This guy's landing gear is already down. So, I wasn't like, you can let him through. I wasn't like a hundred degrees and it's the middle of October. This is not Halloween weather. CHP is. Man, Big Flipper always looks great. Alright, now that's the trailer I was talking about. That's what we're going to put the machine on. That's what those things need to be transported on. that's missing is CHP to fill the lane. Hello. These are my container slings. <clears throat> Notice that gap is closed now. Oh! Dang. Not so much pressure's on there. Dang. That was your truck that made that call. That was my truck. That was your truck. So we got a... Uh, the container thing in here, my dad's doing this as a safety. Just as a safety until CHP shuts down the freeway. Sometimes they take a while, they're, they're backed up and stuff. So we noticed that the gap here was getting bigger. So to prevent it from falling over, we got it held here. Uh, can I just say, I love these container slings. Uh, I think it's Bailey's Towing Accessories.com. I'll put the link in the description of where I get mine. These were custom built for me. 
the normal one just has this here and i got these with the protective cover over the blue nylon i mean uh the thread part they're called peppa's container slings get a set oh my dad is more of a cowboy than i am yes he did the math and we'll only each be picking up 25,000 pounds with big flippers weight it's more than capable of doing it off the back pocket short jack <clears throat> just take too long to wait for CHP so we want this freeway pit before they even get here notice how my dad let go completely with the, the safety here on big flipper and the landing gear didn't move I'm now holding it on my end I'll leave that there for now Hulk you're strong we're ready not yet not yet wait till we get the front done too gotta be done quick 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 rotating to me the boom extend out I know you did go boom up boom up Okay, now we're in. Boom in. It's good now. All right, other side, please, and then we're done. All right. All before CHP came. Let's go. These tool boxes. people on the freeway we're able to do this all off the side on the dangerous part without having to shut this lane down let me get the last lock up front all the locks all the locks are good yeah yeah all right moment of truth I'm boomed out over the center the center of the thing is here my boom is like around here because as we pick up we're on the slope I don't want it to swing into my truck so I got a lot of buffer room <clears throat> beautiful See how I kept it like that? My dad's so old school he doesn't like using the wireless remote. CHP is here. Hey, shut up all the traffic. Shut up 
Okay. Can you have CHP stop the traffic? We're ready. Yeah, to clear the outrigger, just hug left, hug left. He's doing great. My side's cold and I'm great! You guys are in luck. We got a two for one special today. My, uh, it was, it was like pushing a hundred over there. And for some reason my GoPro was overheating. I tried to take out the battery to put in a new one because it was low. And the battery was giving me a hard time coming out. Looks like it expanded. So I let it cool down in the truck, finished that job, and I went straight here. Um, we got a private call to offload two reefer containers, lightly loaded, 40 feet in length. They want them backed up here while I was doing that other winch um, lift job with my dad. These guys were loading these up. Now we're in Beverly Hills, some country club kind of thing. They're doing an event. So they want the doors to open here and they want them staggered. They actually requested a rotator because of they're gonna want to move like inch by inch until they're satisfied. So here I am. I beat the guys, they just got here. I've been here for about 15 minutes. We got Jose first and Enrique behind them. gonna make this really tight turn hug it good so they're gonna go forward and then jackknife well that's what I'm for they don't have to get perfect oh man I just noticed the doors aren't the right way. Ah. They want the doors facing that way. So, this sucks. I got an idea though that I've been wanting to try for a while. I've never done a container with the spreader bar before. I'm gonna have to move my truck even more. Good job, Joe. Very good job. Move it completely out of the 
of the way. I want you as much in that corner as possible because I'm going to park here next to you, pick it up and swing it around 360. I mean, three, 360, 180. 360 will get me right back where I'm at. Yeah, because there's two and there's not going to be enough space to flip them both 180, swing it all the way around. I need my outriggers all the way extended. I need a lot of room for that. We don't have that. So I'm going to do a, a spreader bar. You know what? You want the doors facing out that way, right? Okay. Yeah, they loaded them up wrong. So I'm going to use my truck and a spreader bar to just lift it up and then we can spin it. Spin it. Exactly. Even that's going to be a mission. <clears throat> Like I said, I've never done it this way before, so I'm curious to see how this works. like that this side needs to be more the other side needs to be tighter right I remember I told you drive out and I'm gonna go down with the thing and then we'll flip it drive out well this is a uh, I must have not accounted my links right on the other side. Ah, Joe. Flip it now. <clears throat> Flip it. That's awesome. Good. Huh? 
That is awesome. Can you pull, can you pull out any further? I'm extended out fully, but I can always reposition. This is just to get the doors facing this way. Okay. This okay. is the hard part. Okay. From here, I can drop it and put it much re-rig. So you can drop it and then move your rig? Okay. Okay, let me just leave it right here. Yeah, no problem. Where do you want? Just one more time, tell me where you want. Where? That corner right here. Or further that way. Whatever yeah. that corner lines up. You want on the edge you want this closer. corner here? Yeah. yeah. Or basically that this corner needs here. to be where he is. So where this lands near the concrete. Okay, well now that I did this, let me re-rig. No problem. You want to do it out? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Papitas. You want it? You want him set up on those four bikes? No, no. Yeah, he can move the four. He where he's standing, he wants that corner here, and, and that corner there. there. You want it at an at an angle? Okay. okay. All right. I think <coughs> you want him like this. Terrible. Hey, maybe we could. Now I'm gonna move. Okay. The locks do tilted. Oh, okay. So this way they're flatter. They're flatter. Okay. So let's take them off. Joe, move these. Like take take all those off. Okay. From right there. <coughs> I'm gonna put my outriggers away and get closer to it so okay. I can push it. When was that 7 What's the second one? Gotta admit, I impressed myself on that one. I've never done that before. Okay. Yeah, I'll do that right now. Now that we got it a uh, whole closer, now I can push it out to the customer's satisfaction. Let me uh off the ground. That's maxed out? No. I don't need it maxed out. The thing's empty. Or what is it, like a few thousand? Uh, yeah. Those reefers. So you're just gonna get and swing it over then. Yeah. Just get a little swing. You have to have the front doors on, or are you just gonna put up something temporary? container let me know when to stop Good. are we good back there you gotta set it up. Towards you? Yeah. yeah. Nice. Gosh, it's gonna sit up on here. I can move this. But you want it sitting on that board like that, right? Yeah. Alright, stand clear. I'm gonna swing it. Guide it, Joe. Got it. Drop it. All right, let me know. Going down.
You're good there? Close enough. How about here? Close enough, partner. Let's go. Damn good, really. One down. One more to go. <laughs> Alright, let's disconnect me the same way. Hey Joe, next time uh, for when we flip the next one, let's let's uh shorten up the links. Okay. Look how much room I have up there. Yeah, okay. Where do you want to go? Like eight? Yeah. Six. Six? Six and six links each each way. Okay. Now I gotta do this one more time. This one's gonna be harder because I won't have all that room to flip it. Ow. We'll see how to do it. Shoot it. This one's gonna be harder, bro, because I won't have all that room. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay, we'll get it. <clears throat> I got an idea, Joe. What? Let's go head in. I'm gonna go ahead. A hundred percent. Oh, I'm gonna go head in. No, no, no. He's gonna go head in. Oh, you wanna get ahead? And I'm gonna pick up over the damn cab. Hundred percent, Joe. How am I gonna flip it in here? There's no way I'm gonna be able to okay. do this. Well, I parked way over there, so I'm out of the way. So have him go forward, back up in here, and then go head in. Okay. You see what I mean? So he's gonna go straight up there, reverse into here to back there where that van is, and then go head in here. A hundred percent, I want that done. Okay. Then when he's ready. I lift it up, Joe, and he just backs up again, and he exits out of here. And you follow him. Right. Enrique. Get I won't be able to do the same thing no, I know. because of the space. So what I'm going to have you do is go forward up in there. Yeah. Reverse in here. Okay. Reverse all the way to there, and then just drive head in. Okay. You're going to drive head in. I'm going to pick up over your cab. Okay. I'm going to pick it up in the air sky high. And then you're gonna, once I get it up in there, you just back up out of here and, and you're good to go, man. Right. Now, when I do that, I don't need a, a spreader bar no more. Okay. Not for this one. Because if I'm gonna go over the cab. Question for you, young man. How are we gonna spin the next one with this trailer in your way? I'm not. I'm gonna have him drive head in and boom over his cab. You got it made. <laughs> I've done this one one or two times. Right. I didn't know if you had the enough No, that there's not near it like you said. Your wife should think that there's no room to spin it in here. Yeah. And I didn't know if you had enough height to pick over the cat with the cat. I guess you will because you're already fine. You'll figure you know what to do. All right, we're gonna be doing part two of the second container and for this one I'm gonna go over the cab believe it or not back a little bit more that way you can swing it this way more exactly all right really happy with how this is coming out excuse the mess we'll be using these got my strap protectors on here i mean holders let me take these off Yeah, this truck needs a decontamination ASAP. So I'm gonna be using four 10 footers attached to my rim slings via shackles. And that's how I'm gonna boom over the cab. The only reason I did it with the spreader bar in the first one is so I can get that 180 degree pivot. As you can see, it turns super easy. Let's do this. Hi, Joe. <coughs> Remember the freeze pull. All right. <clears throat> so 
again, this method is preferred because I don't have any room right here to spin the container. And when they got loaded, they loaded them up wrong at the facility. These are supposed to be backwards. That's all right. That's what I got Hulk for. I put my... Uh, Joe put my container slings in each pocket. That's connected with a shackle, which is connected with a 10 foot strap on each end. Those container slings are for rated like at 32,000 in a basket. Each strap is rated at 20. The shackles are uh, 17 tons each. So I'm more than ready for this. And if you'll notice, my boom, it's going to purposely start past the midpoint on this way i want that on purpose because when i start i wanted to swing this way to get away from the front right there on the step then i boom up then when i rotate to center myself uh i'm already closer to where they want it <clears throat> it'll make sense right now when i start lifting all right ready Hold on, Joe. Let me get the part over there. Perfect. <clears throat> Excellent. Now I can rotate back towards the middle and watch it come up even as I extend out. Extend out a lot. Yeah, let's go out with the cables first. That's good. <clears throat> it's all right. It's all right. As I swing towards the middle, it's going to be perfectly even. It's because I started so offset. Let me jump down from here. Whoa! Let me stand on this side, actually. This is risky stuff when you're playing with angles and... Stuff like this. P 
picture time, Joe. A TikTok video. Bring it back. Bring it back, Joe. Yeah, me too. <coughs> The reason I did this is now when I go down and I swing, it's already going to be perfect. I don't have to re-rig. <clears throat> okay, if you guys want to guide me in the front where you want it. Look, now I don't have to re-rig. Yeah. One shot. Yeah. Now I gotta do the front for them. Back is secure. Easy as one, two, three. It's then back here where it's more shade. I think I'm for sure gonna have to fix my cables at the shop today. Get them wrapped been super busy and haven't done that in like a week it's fine it'll even out itself I'm gonna just do a quick pick. Ready? Yeah. Slowly. Okay, let me know when I can drop. Alright, All right, Joe, I need the last two one done up there, please. What a great job. Woo! I'm tired. Those are just to hold my uh, straps together. Because I'm a neat freak. Are we outro? Huh? We done? We were done. Oh, the payment is the car didn't go through. It went through. It went through. Trust oh. me, I, would, I wouldn't have dropped if hey, I didn't get payment. Huh? You know, this was That's good. I, was, I thought it was a lot of work. Well, you know what? You know why? 
Because I this didn't have to load it. Huh? I didn't have to load it. And it wasn't their fault that these things were loaded backwards. I wish they would have told us, you know, like in the email, they have to be off loaded a certain way. You. I was all like, okay. See, imagine if those people are like, I don't need a rotator, just a rollback for the container, and you get a job like this, what are they going to do? Right. I'm always right. <laughs> all right, we're done. My hands look like I've been swimming. That's disgusting. It's all sweat. Here. 98 right here. Do you guys still need me? <laughs> no, they cancel the whole car, Joshua. Oh, man. No, I have... It's going to make for a nice YouTube video. Tighten up your green. Yeah. Yeah. Alright guys, everything's put away. Fantastic job, great teamwork by everyone. I need to go back to the shop. Freshen up. Get some water and Gatorade in us. And clean the trucks. Hope you all enjoy. Peace.